Hey guys, welcome to Ginger and the L Tutorials. And I'm Ginger. And today I'm here to show you, um, to tell you actually my first impressions on the Kai Shadow. And it comes with nine shades. And it looks like this. If you guys want to know how I got this look, then keep on watching. So this is the palette, it's the cash shadow and it comes with nine shades and it's the bronze palette. This is what the palette looks like, okay? And we have nine shades and I'm gonna swatch them really quick before I start my first impressions. So this first one here, it's called Jasper. And I'm gonna swatch it right here. Okay, the next one is Quartz. And the next one is Jasper. This is Tiger Eye. The next one is Citrine, it's the orange. We have Goldstone. So next is Obsidian. This is Bronzai. And the black one is hematite. Okay, these are the swatches, guys. Then let's jump into the video tutorial. I mean, first impressions. So first, I'll be priming my eyes using the, the Pro Longwear Paint Pot by MAC in the color Painterly. And I'm going to be using a Morphe M334, an angle brush. Next, I'm going to be setting this using the Laura Mercier translucent powder and using any fluffy brush that you have. This one is the Morphe M504. It's going to be setting the whole lid where we applied the primer, paint pot. Now we are going to jump in to the fun part of this video, the palette. Oh, oh. Kylie, next time, please put a mirror in this palette because it would be, it would make us our lives so much easier. Okay, girl. Okay. Bam. So first, I'm gonna grab the Morphe. M30 and I'm gonna be grabbing Jasper as my transition shade. And I'm gonna be just applying this right high on the crease. Mm -hmm. 
I'm just going to be doing the same exact thing with the other eye. Just in the crease. With the Morphe M33, I'm going to be grabbing Citrine and I'm going to be blending with Jasper. So this shade Citrine has a lot of kickback. I'm going to be grabbing Goldstone with the same Morphe 433 as you guys can see. Look at this kickback. Look, it's too powdery. But it's okay, let's work with this. I'm just going to be grabbing over here and giving some death. So this eye. So far, these colors they are blending so well. I don't have any problem blending them out, which is good. And now I'm going to be grabbing Hematide with a pencil brush and this is by Morphe M431 and as you guys can see, I'm a Morphe girl. We're going to apply here in the outer corner just here to give a little bit more to this eye. Can you see this fellow right here? Okay, let's just not talk about it. Yeah, it's a lot, I know. I wish there was not much fallout. Look. Can you see this? Okay. So far, this is blending so well. There have been complaints besides the fallout and the kickback. Go back with look at this. Can you see? Can you guys see this fell out right here in the palette? Can you guys see this? This is crazy. Okay. Now we're gonna grab the same Morphe M33 and we're just gonna go back and Blend that out. I'm just gonna blend until our hands fall out. I'm 
Now I'm gonna grab bronzei and to give even more that because I'm just gonna concentrate this color right here in the angle. I know it's not blending well. We're just gonna blend this. Use a Morphe E18, a clean brush, and let's blend these edges right here. And just grab a little bit more. This is pigmented. Gonna go back with the same pencil brush M431. I'm gonna do the same thing on the other eye. Let's back that over and blend. I'm kind of having a little bit of trouble blending this in. Let's go back and grab one. Now with a clean brush, I'm going to be using the Morphe M441 with the Citrine. We're going to go back and blend. I'm not blending like really heavy. I'm using my hand really light because I just want to give that airbrush finish. I have to make sure that we're blending really soft. Okay. I kind of see here that this eye right here it's kind of patchy. We're just going to fix it. This eye, I don't know, it, it doesn't want to blend this bronzite color. In this eye, it blended perfectly, but in this one, I don't know, it doesn't want to blend, and I'm blending for it like... Just go back with the M433, let's see what it's going to do with this. Okay, just a little bit. Going back with the trying and blending the edges. With any synthetic brush, by the way, this is by BH Cosmetics. I'm just going to grab Jasper and then we're going to. Do you see this? This is really pigmented. I thought it was not going to be this pigmented, but we're just going to blend this. I 
With a clean brush, I'm going to use the M441. We're just going to soften it, this one right here. Same shape, just going to peel up the line and apply it all in the part, in the area that we didn't apply any shadow. And then we're going to go back with the Morphe M441, a clean brush, and we're just going to blend. that everything is united. Okay, now with a Morphe E36, we're gonna grab the shade Quartz, and I'm gonna use this shade as my intercorneal highlight. Where's the glow? Now we're going to clean this under eye area because we had too, many, too much fun about. I'm going to do my lower lash line now and I'm going to grab Tiger Eye and Hermitai together and I'm using a Veronana brush. Just a close With the flat brush M432, I'm going to be grabbing bronzer and I'm going to on the center, all over here. And now we're gonna smoke that out with MA18 and using Tiger Eye. Now I'm going to grab my Aqua XL Eye Pencil by Makeup Forever in number N10. And I'm going to be applying this in my lower lash line. And we're going to go back with the same Morphe E18 and we're just going to blend that out one more time. Just to make sure that everything is blended. Now I'm just going to apply some mascara and I'm going to be using my favorite one, Better Than Sex. By Too Faced.
Hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial. And uh, if you liked it, make sure to give it a thumbs up. And make sure to subscribe to our channel to get no more videos. And if you have any idea or any request of new looks or things that you want us to show to you, to you guys here, then just comment down below. Thank you, and I see you soon. Bye.